WTFNN. Headline news update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 1 p.m. Eastern time on Thursday. <clears throat> Excuse me. Markets in negative territory. We got the Dow currently negative 47 points, trading at 26,109. We got the NASDAQ negative by 8 points, trading at 79.56. And S&P is currently negative by 4, trading at 2890. Oil pulling back a bit off a of buck 22, trading at 63.39. We got gold pulling back as well, down $17, trading at 12.96.30. Dollar index up 202 ticks, trading at 96.760. Notes and bonds lower price, higher yield 10-year note, negative seven ticks, 123.18. 30-year bond negative 12 ticks. 147.27. We'll start things off, and we're going to start it off actually with the Dow. So some of the movers and the shakers in the Dow in positive territory. We got Boeing putting 17 positive points in the Dow. Caterpillar putting seven. Home Depot putting seven. The big culprit on the negative side, United Health. Now United down nine dollars, trading at 237.03. But United itself putting 61 negative points. And that's more than the whole Dow. So without that United Health, the Dow would actually be in positive territory. With that in mind, we'll jump back to the charts, jump through some of the futures. We'll start it off with the NASDAQ 100, currently trading 76.28. Kind of just been hanging down here since the market opened, pretty much right where we almost opened. There's your opening bell. Bar trading at 76.47, trade lower for a bit, and then just hanging at that level. Dow 30, a little bit of an escalation to lower prices from about 11 o'clock. We trade from 26,203, quite a spike lower just before noon to 26,085. Just kind of hanging down at that, at that level since then. S&P is trading at 28.91. Crude oil, as we said, pulling back quite a bit from yesterday's highs. We were up there at 64.69, basically about 24 hours ago, and quite a slide, trading 63.52. Gold contract pulling back as well to pull back to those highs. Again, excuse me, we're going back to yesterday, about 24 hours ago, trading at 13 14 almost $18 off that level with gold at session lows of 12 96 And natural gas, we got EIA inventories today. We saw a build of about 23 billion cubic feet. The estimate had been for an increase of about 35. Nonetheless, lower prices, 266 in the price of May natural gas. Stay tuned, folks. We got a man, Steve Rhodes, coming up right now with the Trader's Edge. Dave White live at 2 o'clock with a power trading hour. Tom O'Brien live from 3, 3 till 5. Stay tuned, folks. Steve Rhodes coming up right now.